Hi there guys, a big hello to all you current and future vapors out there. Today we're doing a juice review. I think I've reached juice nirvana. It took some getting to, you know, it didn't come easy, but breakfast at Telios, the milk. Okay, breakfast at Telios the Milk. I'll tell you a little bit about it first, but we'll start with the description style way. It's the second juice in the breakfast at Telios e juice line. They have a, a crunch one which is mixed with uh, fruit, like a fruit loop and milk. It's the milk. The milk pays homage to one of our favourite drinks fruity cereal milk from Momofuku Milk Bar in Brooklyn. For those that don't know, most of us I presume, it's a drink made by steeping a popular fruity cereal in whole milk with a few other key ingredients. It is then vigorously stirred and strained. When Momofuku does it, they get one of the most delicious drinks on the planet. When Telios does it, they get the milk. Okay. Comes in 30 ml bottles, glass stripper bottles, £16.50, I found it for vapehype.com, okay, it's a 70-30 VGPG blend, and you can get it in 3, 6 and 12 milligrams nicotine, and it tastes glorious, if like me you like your cereal milk creamy type vapes which I presume a lot of people must do because we're being inundated by them at the moment you know cereal milk the milk man uh, mama's milk telios the milk but they are very very nice they are very, as soon as I seen I think kilo cereal milk was the first one I seen I thought uh, that vapes like the milk from the bottom of a cereal bowl, I mean, you know, it's, it's uh, and they are glorious vapes. Yeah, milky, creamy, much like Kilo cereal milk. If you've had cereal milk by Kilo, it's a very similar kind of uh, kind of vapes with a little a little twist but I am unhappy with Telios because they sent this bottle out wildly understeeped when I first received this bottle I greedily opened my package put it in a tank I think it was a Nautilus Mini filled it up but luckily they only hold two mil filled it up vape Tasted like perfume. Tasted like I was vaping perfume. It must have been made in the factory and then sent out the same day and been received by whatever I bought it from, I'm not sure. A few days later, <clears throat> and then they sent it out to me because it, it, it hadn't even been steeped a week. It tasted like perfume. I've had it now about six days I think yeah I've had it about six seven days and I've had it in my ultrasonic cleaner on a 90 minute cycle twice and it now is perfect okay after a six day steep and a 90 minute cycle in the ultrasonic bath it still had a little uh, it wasn't right a further 90 minutes deep and now it's right now it is how they should have sent it out in the first place why they sent it out like they did I have no idea because if it, if I was a newbie or somebody who didn't know anything about steeping I would have tasted that juice and just thought Jesus that, that tastes like perfume get rid of that and I'd have put it away and I'd never gone back to it it's just you know, with my experience from vaping and watching videos because I'm an 
enthusiast or hobbyist or whatever you say, a, a vaping addict. I knew that it was understeeped, so I left it. Uh, I popped it in my ultrasonic cleaner. And as I say, it took two 90-minute cycles and a further six days. Now it tastes perfect. Now it is ambrosia. Now it is vaping heaven. Yeah, it's a lot like cereal milk. It's slightly less creamy, milky, but it's just got a little, little something. It's not a fruitiness. It's just, um, it's nice. Try it. Try it. It really is. It's, it's an all day of it for me, without a doubt. Without a doubt, you know, now that the bottle is perfect, I'll probably vape this till it's all gone because I love my cereal vapes and I've no kilo cereal milk left. I made some of my own cereal DIY juice <clears throat> that is quite nice. The recipe for that is on my um, ultrasonic bath steeping cleaning video that I put up the other day if you want to uh, replicate that it's quite nice and this is also very nice um, they also do breakfast at Telios crunch which is the milk mixed with I think the Americans call them Fruit Loops, so some cereal that they eat over there. I've seen it over here, it's a children's fruit kind of cereal. So I suppose that has like a fruit kind of flavour. I will be trying that one as well, and I'll bring you a review when I do. But uh, if you can get your hands on a bottle of this anytime in the near future, then uh, I recommend you do, guys, because... It's a very nice vape. If you like dessert vapes, custard, creamy, if you've got a sweet tooth, you'll enjoy this one. But you may get it understeeped like I did. If it tastes perfumey or like you're vaping Estee Lauder, if you've got an ultrasonic bath, put it through a few cycles, three hours, you know, two two hour cycles, two 90 minute cycles, whatever. If you don't, then put it in a cupboard for two weeks and then try it. Don't just write it off because um, they do seem to be sending them out understeeped. But once it ages and gets to where it's meant to be, It's nice, it's nice. Probably in my top three of all vapes at the moment, that one. Yeah, easily in my top three. It's, it's very nice, very nice. I'm ranting crazy of it because I've only just actually given it the second 90 minute cycle this evening. So tonight is the first night I've actually tasted it at its true highest potential without none of the perfumey undertones and aftertastes and <clears throat> it's in my top three and I've got quite a few juices so um, mm, top marks for Telios from this one if they'd like to send me their recipe I'd uh, gladly um, receive that I'll keep it a secret I promise but I'll make plenty of it for myself <laughs> Uh, do we think that's likely? I just can't stop vaping it. It's got oh, it's nice. Get yourself a bottle, give it a try. It's a lovely vape. It's a lovely vape. It's easily as nice as, if not better than kilo cereal milk. I'd say it beats the vaping rabbit, um, the milkman. It's uh, yeah, it's a winner that they've found there. So, that was uh, Breakfast at Telios. The milk. Definitely a nice juice. On your way out, if you wouldn't mind clicking the subscribe button, it would be appreciated. We're trying to get to 
500 subscribers <clears throat> so I could start the first competition and give away 100 millilitres of premium e-juice and 100 millilitres of standard e-juice and some and decan and 100 ml of Space Jam proper premium stuff. So there'll be 200 ml all in all once I get to 500 subscribers. Once I get to 1,000, I'm giving away a um, Dimitri unregulated box mod. At 1,500 subscribers, a dot mod Petri mechanical mod. And at 2,000, if I get to 2,000, I need to get to these subscriber marks. But should I get to 2,000 subscribers, I will be giving away to one lucky viewer a dot mod Petri mod and matching RDA and I have a dot mod mod and RDA here and um, it's a very good mechanical mod it's the best mechanical mod I've used you know it's a lovely smooth micro engraved button it's a 22 karat gold plated deck you know the, the RDA is excellent for temperature control devices with it having such good conductivity with the gold and um, and it vapes like a champ so uh, yeah if we can get up there you could be the lucky winner so if you click the subscribe on your way out it would be appreciated guys and if you've enjoyed the video give me a like if you've not enjoyed it i'll see you next time <laughs> thanks for watching and don't forget the most important thing no smoking keep on vaping thanks for watching guys